What's up, everybody? I got a good one for y'all this time. Get ready, because as soon as I hit record, this lady starts running her mouth, and I had to put her in her place real quick. Y'all enjoy it. We don't need your unlawful directives. Go back to work. Shut your mouth. If I got to tell you again, it's going to be on a postcard. I'll call her a wambulance. <clears throat> impeding is a physical act. I'm not impeding anything. Learn the law. This guy's fucking up. Should never take a field sobriety test. Never. Oh, we got more of them. I heard her feelings, y'all. Way. She's pissed. Should not do this, bro. Don't ever take a field sobriety test, y'all.
start taking nine millitone steps back down the line like this. One, two, three. Look at her laughing, y'all. I see that lady pig laughing. Y'all see that bitch laughing? Look at her laughing. Sucks, man. He should have never took the field sobriety test, y'all. He should have kept his mouth shut and refused everything. They're going to fucking search his vehicle now. <clears throat> Alright, y'all, I gotta switch my batteries out. There they go, searching his vehicle. Look at all these fucking cops, y'all. Another one just pulled up. Got these two over here conspiring. You guys don't go there. anywhere because it's about to get real good. We're about to have a new star mm. enter the video, and he just can't keep his mouth mm. shut. And 
I have two more confrontations with this guy, and um, I have to school him on the law a little bit. Um, I'm going to try to cut out a lot of this dead time that's in this video. I don't want it to be an hour long. I could have made two videos out of this, but I don't want to do that. So y'all bear with it. You don't want to miss this. Taking him to jail. Look at all these clowns that were hiding behind the police car. Bootlickers. like some fraternization going on. There they go. So, okay, so what's your new YouTube channel? Talking to me? Yeah. Talking to me. Um, Harvey, I just changed it. <laughs> Harvey Freebird. Har Harvey Freebird. Yeah, Freebird. Harvey like the Freebird. song Freebird. Freebird. Yeah. Uh, this is why I think they call them pigs. Because you know how pigs like to root through stiff stuff and tear everybody's stuff up? Yeah. That's don't what they're doing. They're rooting there. through this man's car. Yeah, everybody in our side up on the porch up there. But I had to call one of them a boot look at his face. Oh, she done found something already. I'll leave the guy alone, man, right? Still when he gets out. Dude, he doesn't even have a tag. How dumb can you be oh, driving around drunk he's without a tag? He, I don't want to say he deserved to go, but come on. How do you drive without a tag? That's, that's probably the reason to stop. I mean, allegedly drunk. Allegedly drunk, right. But I tried to do that thing with my foot. I can do it. Dude, sober people can't even do it. I, I know. It's impossible to pass the I'm sober. Look, I'm shaking. Yeah. Yeah, it's not, it's not it's really easy hard. to do. And I think you have to leave your hands down, too. And then when they ask you to take one, they already think you're drunk, so the judging is not in you. They're going to judge it against you anyway. I know. Best thing to do is not take it and keep your mouth shut. I'm going to ask this guy, like, when you do the, the, this one, do you have to put, can you put your hands out, or do they have to be to your side? I forgot. I'm going to get a little bit closer. When you, when you do the foot one, do you have to put your arms to the side, or uh, out like, can you put them out like this? Look at her rooting through that car like a pig, y'all. Can you put them by the side, or can you put them out? Oh, that's hard. I, I can't even do it. Like, I'm shaking. Yes, ma'am. It's hard to do. Really hard in high heels. <laughs> Definitely hard in high heels. I want to take my high heels off. <laughs> you have to keep your hands to the side so you can't use them as balancing. So when you do your, your, your foot thing, you have to keep your hands to the side. I, I can tell you, I'll never take another one ever again. Yeah, I know. <laughs> And forget it. Take me to jail, and right? This one, like, now. The heels to toe thing is like really kind of hard to do too because you got to keep your hands to the side. Look, look. It's hard to do when you don't have your arms to balance. Yeah. And I'm, I'm sober. Yeah, those are designed to be used against you. That's why you should I, never take one. I have a video about that. You've probably seen it. And the one that Lackluster did on my video, that's what he did it on. Okay, so. So. She's trying to turn that regular pin into some uh, uh, paraphernalia, y'all. It's just a regular uh, pin. Just leave him alone. He's already got twenty twenty thousand. Just leave him alone. He's already got twenty thousand dollar debt now. Don't don't fall anything else on it. Okay, so so look, I'm sober. Can you see me? Look at Carolina so, trying yeah, to take the sobriety test. So like you have to keep your hands to your side. You can't use them for balancing. Even on a tightrope, they have a balancing rod. Yeah. Okay. It's not easy to so do. It's not easy to do. Look. Oh, I'm sober too. See? It's hard to do. You should try it. I believe you. I know. I can't. I can't, you I can't do it sober. You could do drunk for sure. I can't even do it sober. I thought because when I was younger. Did y'all see that? It's hard to do. She 
trying to turn that pin into something. Oh, leave the guy alone. He's already going to be in mess trouble. What is that? It looks like a fucking pin to me. It's probably one hitter. It's a one hitter. Crack pipe? No. It looks like a pin from here. It's a one hitter. Oh, it's for weed? I think so. Jesus, who cares? Who, this, he's already crime. in enough trouble. Victimless crime. It's a victimless crime, isn't that? <laughs> isn't that a victimless crime? I think victimless so. Crime. Don't be mean. Just let him. Come on, man. Don't be mean. War on drugs. The war. Don't be mean. The war on drugs is you a should, war you on the not people. Be mean. You, should, you should be nice. Did you look nice? Did you did you did you hear what she said when I first got out? Yeah. She started hollering at me. I told her to shut her mouth. I know. Like, <laughs> shut your mouth. Uh, Aww. Don't be a mean lady. She's gonna be a mean lady. Look, we found this paraphernalia too. We found this pen. It smells like weed. We're gonna test it for residue. We're gonna be. We're gonna just get here and we're gonna get this guy for everything we can. There might be an apple. There might be an apple in there that can use the pipe. Should Man's already getting right. his car towed. That's going to cost three or four hundred dollars to get his ta car out. Yeah. Probably going to lose he, his job. He, he, spend a week or two in jail. He'll lose the place he's living. By the time he gets out of jail, the damn tow fee will be so high he won't be able to get his car out. He could potentially lose everything he owns over this. Happens to a lot of people. You think these three, four officers care? Nope. They're just following orders. They're going to stop me and make me do this for you. I think we should go see if she has any drugs in her car. You want to go ask her? No, I want to go look. Which car is hers? That one right there. I'm going to have to go check it out, y'all. Let's see if we can smell some marijuana odor coming out of her car. I'm not breaking the law, man. I never said you were. We I don't just, need your directives. I, I, I just don't want you. I just don't want. Just go back to work, this? man. You see this? That's exactly. That's exactly why I moved you out the way. Well, you're in the way right now. No, I'm not. Come on. You're I'm in. Way. I'm standing in a parking spot. Now you're standing in a parking spot. We don't need your directives. Go back to work. I thought I smelled an odor of marijuana coming out of this police car. I was just seeing. Hey, back to the car, okay? Back out of the street. And brother, you know you didn't smell an odor of marijuana coming out that police car. Come on. You mind if I look? You mind if I look through it? Come on, brother. You know you know better than that. If you don't have nothing to hide, why Man, can't I, I look through it? I have nothing to hide, but brother, you know better than that. Well, ain't that what y'all say to us? If you don't have nothing to hide, it shouldn't Come be a problem. On, brother. Come on, man. You know you do not smell an odor of marijuana right now. Hey, I, I thought I smelled something. Oh, okay, well, you, you come on, brother. You know better than that. Hey, you mind taking your hand out of your pocket? You're making me nervous. No, my, this is this is me pulling for that. So you're making me nervous holding that camera. Oh, good Lord. <laughs> Y'all hear this guy? Yeah, you, see, you, you see how that Tate, goes? Arm to the teeth, and I'm making him nervous. You see how that goes? Yeah, y'all should spend a little more time in the law library and less time in the gun room. <clears throat> if you can come up with a penal code I'm breaking, let me know. I'll be glad to move. Hey, can I get your name and your badge number since you engaged me? Yes, sir. You surely can. Yeah. Jay Houston? 
Just like Houston, Texas. Houston, Texas. IDT 2390, brother. Cool. 2390. Yeah. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, uh, you walk. You walk. I just wanted to look through there for real quick. It wouldn't take long at all. Just take a quick look around. I don't see what the problem is if you don't have anything to hide. Said I'm making him nervous with my camera. Good lord. Here comes the tow truck. This is what you call legalized theft right here. <clears throat> See if I can see anything illegal in this guy's car. I swear I smell something from somewhere. Look, he's got his computer open. Hey, sir. Get back up in that sir, I need you to back up from this building. Am I breaking the law? I need you to back up from this vehicle. I'm not breaking any law. I never said you were breaking the law. I'm just telling you that I need you to back up from this it's vehicle. It's an unlawful directive. I never said that you were breaking the law. <clears throat> I don't need your unlawful that, directive. What I'm saying is that I did not give you an unlawful directive. Yes, All I did. said is that I needed you to back up from this vehicle. You're asking me to. Would you please? I'm going to decline. Back up. Would you please back I'm gonna up decline. from the vehicle? I'm going to decline that request, sir. Nothing else better to do tonight, huh? Well, I mean, now you now you guys know how it feels to have somebody intruding in on your shit. No, we're not intruding. We, brother, I, I don't know who you are. I've never heard of you, never seen you, so I've never intruded on anything about you, anything. I'm, I'm talking about police in general. Police in general. You didn't like, I didn't even open your door and start. I, ne I never said you did. I never said you did. Nothing else better to do tonight. You're what the people want, man. Yeah. People can't get enough of this shit, bro. Yeah. If y'all would just ignore us, nobody would watch this stuff. Y'all can't help it. Well, it's just, it's just all about, it's always about safety, man. Just making sure that everybody's safe. It's not, it's not that we're here to ignore you. We just want to make sure that everybody's safe. You don't get hit when you were standing there. That's why that car needs to come by. Well, look. All right. So I know, I know you don't know a lot about the law, but I'll tell you a little something about it. The Supreme Court ruled that police have no obligation, none, zero, whatsoever, of public safety. It's Castle Rock versus Gonzalez. You should look into it. Okay. Y'all's job is only law enforcement. All this public safety crap. I mean, it's it, it sounds good, but it's it's none of it's true. Well, that That's car, not y'all's that, job. If, Public if, safety if had, is not your guys' job. The Supreme Court told, has ruled on if that. If I hadn't told you to move out the, out the way for that vehicle, you don't think that vehicle would have struck you? Your my, my safety's not your responsibility. When I saw the vehicle coming, I moved out of the way. I'm okay. not stupid. I made it almost 50 years by myself. I don't need you I telling never, me to get I, out of the I road. Never, I never You're said standing you in the road telling I, me to get out of the road. I was Come standing on, man. way out of the traffic of that vehicle that was driving. Oh, good Lord. Y'all hear me say my life, y'all. I never said I saved your life, <laughs> Yeah, you did. You said the vehicle would have hit me if you wouldn't have told me to move. Good Lord. I got the whole thing on film, man. Well, good, good. You're just digging your hole deeper, man. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank I you. mean, come on, man. Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. Everybody's going to see this, bro, and be like, I man, this dude, I this dude is something serious, man.
You got anything else you want to add? No, nah, not at all. You want to tell us Take some more? Care. Be safe tonight, man. God bless. You want to give us some more cop logic? Some no, more cop man, that's, explaining? That's not cop logic, brother. That's <laughs> that brother to brother, man. Do you, do you have anything lawful to say? That's brother to brother, man. That's not. It, have, it doesn't always have to be a cop thing. It's just brother to brother. Brother to brother. Yeah, brother to brother, man. I was just looking, seeing maybe if I saw any burner guns or drugs or anything in y'all's vehicles. Now, there's a lot of stuff in the news about cops planting drugs on people, you know? Well, brother, I can tell you right now. Burner man, guns and... I am not one of those. Do you mind if we look around? Uh, that's what you're doing now, isn't it? No, I mean like look around, search. No, you're not. You give us consent? No, sir. You're not getting them up there. Just asking, man. No, sir. Just asking. If you don't have anything to hide, then, you know, you ought to, you ought to be okay with it. You guys good to go? All right, man. Thank y'all for your help, brothers. I appreciate it. All right. Let me know if y'all need anything, all right? Thank you, man. Brother, y'all be safe tonight, okay? Hey, you too, bro. Thank you, sir. I don't want anything, I don't want anything bad to happen to you guys. Trust uh, me. Y'all be safe. I believe you. Be safe today, brother.